Hey, welcome to my channel. I am Divine Empress, and I was just want to come um, do a reading, and I just want to let you all know. Yes, my channel will always be dedicated to Taurus, but I'm getting ready. It's opened up for everybody now. Um, I still have some things I still want to do with the Taurus tribe. No worries. We're going to take care of that. But for the most part, my channel is open for everybody. I'm going to be doing readings for all the signs that want me to do readings, that, that need readings. And I'm getting ready to do collective readings now, okay? Just want to let you all know my Patreon should be up pretty soon. My Taurus tribe are more than welcome to go over there and join. I give y'all that information once they, you know, they got to make the page go live or whatever. I don't know. Check it out. So we're going to see what's going on. But right now we're going to get some messages and see what's going on with the collective. What's going on, spirit? What's at the bottom of the deck? Six of Wands, success. Okay. All right. What's going on? Oh, the Ace of Pentacles. Coming in fast. Something is, so, oh, somebody's charging in fast. Something coming in fast. Tempers is here to bring balance. That's Sagittarius. You could be messing with, you could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a Sagittarius. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You got the three of cups. You have um, this Cancer Pisces Scorpio. The fool. What else, spirit? Seven of cups. Ace of cups. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Somebody is somebody uh, want a, want a reconciliation. Okay, and they're charging in fast with this reconciliation with this Ace of Pentacles and this Ace of Cups. This is going to be a stable, loving new beginning, okay? Temperance is here to bring balance, but also telling you to be patient because this person is charging in. They're going to charge in, but you know, you've been patient waiting on this for a long time because somebody had to make up their mind or you had to make up your mind, okay? This is going to be a stable, loving, beautiful beginning, Okay. And it can mean also, you know, I do have, we do got the three of cups and the ace of cups. It might be a pregnancy, who knows? But we're going to see. Let's do a few clarifications and see what spirit want us to know. Okay. What's going on? What's going on? What is going on? Okay. All right, here we go. Why is the temperance card here, spirit? Why is temperance here? Ten of cups. Okay. Why is the three of cups here, spirit? Why is the three of cups here? Why is the three of cups here? Why is the three of cups here, spirit? Okay. Okay, you got the strength. You could be dealing with a Leo. You got the nine of pentacles and you got judgment. Okay, so whoever this person is coming in, this person is coming in to somebody that's single, who doing good, who got their money together, they they taking they taking care of themselves. They probably done started a business started a business. They probably an entrepreneur. Um and then I made a judgment call to come in, okay? This is, um. it looked like they probably want to resurrect something because it is, it is the Three of Cups. And it's going to take strength for them to come in and take this risk, okay? That's what I see. Mm -hmm. Whoever this Nine of Pentacles is, they're doing good. By, they're doing good. Here go the Two of Cups at the bottom of the deck, and you got the Six of Cups again. This is a reconciliation with this two of cups, okay? This is a divine counterpart. This is somebody that you love. This is somebody that you you and this person go get along very, very well, okay? Let's see. Seven of cups. Why is the seven of cups here? Okay. You got the hermit. This person is in hermit mode trying to and juggling their thoughts, trying to figure out what they want to do, okay? 
they, they probably got options. I'm not going to even lie. They got options. But they want to, um, they uh, also, and you got the nine of cups that came out. They want their wish fulfillment, okay? But they, they're going after their wish fulfillment. But what I do see is that this person pretty much is in their head about it. Mm-hmm. Got the swords over their eyes. I don't know what they're trying not to see. But um, they got the swords over their eyes. And you got the Ace of Wands. You got the Ace of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles, and the Ace of uh, Cups. This person is gonna charge in with this. They're gonna take this risk, okay? But they've been they've been in contemplation mode. They've been they they been weighing their options. They've been juggling their thoughts. Had the swords over their eyes and in hermit mode. Like this, per whoever this person is, they stay in their head. Okay, they stay in their head. And it could be a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio because you do got the Six of Cups, the Three of Cups, the Nine of Cups, the Ace of Cups, the Ten of Cups. This got something to do with a water sign. You got Leo. You got Aries Leo Sag. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Sagittarius. What else, spirit? Oh, yeah. This person coming. Yep, yeah, they all in their head. They, they healing from something, too. They recharging their batteries. Probably working a lot. Who knows? They're recharging their batteries. This is who the, the this is um the name the, the the reading is the person most on your mind. This is what they this is what's on their mind. They they thinking about charging. They thinking about yeah they thinking about it. But I think they done made up their mind. And this is the star card, another wish card. Okay, and you got the look. You got oh wow. So you got. You got the four of wands, the three of cups, and the six of cups. They want success. They want victory with this. This is a reconciliation. You got three of cups twice. Hmm. And you got the four of wands. Okay, this is a divine counterpart. You got the two of cups and the uh four of wands. And you got you got the six of cups, three of cups, two of cups. This is somebody coming back from your past. Mm-hmm. Yep. And they're got a victory card again. They want success with this. Okay, the King of Wands. They're ready to come in and use their wand, honey. He, this person, passionate. This is Aries, Leo, Sag. Mm-hmm. Passionate, go getter. Yeah, look good. <laughs> yeah, they've been in hermit mode. You, the hermit card came out twice. Okay, strength done came out twice. So you got Virgo and you got Leo. This person is using. They, this person is getting. They sitting. In isolation, just trying to build up their strength so they can come and make this offer. Mm hmm Because they're coming in, they're coming in with this love. That's what they're doing. Page of Wands. They, this is the new beginning. This is an action card. Okay. And you got the Hierophant. Okay. You got the Hierophant. This is Taurus energy. Okay. This is Taurus. You got the Seven of Pentacles. This person been, in, you know, been waiting to invest. That's why the Temperance. Temperance card is here. They've been waiting to invest it with this ten of this ten of um that ten of cups. Okay. Yeah, they've been waiting. They're all in their head. They're getting downloads from spirit. Okay. This person seemed like they 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 this person is good looking, y'all. Not only is this person good looking, this person um is good with their wand. Okay, this is a wish fulfillment. Okay, you got the wood, you got the uh nine of cups and the star came out twice. Uh-huh. This person's spying on you. Okay, they spying on your social media. Not only on your social media, if they know where you live, they are they they are uh riding by your house. Okay, all right. But they using their strength. They are gaining their strength. That's why they in, in the hermit energy and the four of wands energy because they healing because they they building up their courage so they can come forward. Okay, yeah, they coming forward. Yeah, so you could be dealing with again Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I see a lot of water. A lot of water. I got uh, Virgo. I got Leo. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Sagittarius. Aries, Leo, Sag. You got Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And you got Leo again. You got the Sun card. This is beautiful. Okay. This is absolutely beautiful because at the end of the day, it might be a child involved in this because the sun card represents a baby. It, not a baby, but it represents a family. It could mean that somebody is pregnant. And you got the three of cups that came out twice. And you got the ace of cups. 
and the two of cups. Yeah, darling, and, and the six of cups. This could be a pregnancy. Somebody's gonna get pregnant. Uh, so this is what's this is what's on this person's mind. This person is coming in to make a, make you give you a good offer. This is your twin flame, okay? The four wands it did come out. This is your twin flame. Don't know who your twin flame is, but this is your twin flame. This person been guarded. This person been wounded. Mm -hmm. They've been taking their time. That's why they in, that's why they're building up their strength because they've been insecure about coming in. Because that nine of pentacles, whoever this nine of pentacles is, they know they got to come in correct because this person, this person, like again, can take a relationship or leave it. It's just that simple, okay? But justice is here to bring balance. Mm hmm The justice card is here, okay? Something will come full circle. Y'all money going to be good because you got the ace of pentacles here too. And something will come full circle. So, and look, you're going to have equal give and take in this relationship. I can't make this up. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. So, this is what's on your person's mind, okay? Whether you believe it or not, this is what's on your person's mind. This is, this is, they, they are really, really, they're really trying to, um, gain the courage to come on in. Okay. You got the emperor. This person is dominant. This person may own a business. This person, this person, um, handles their business. I could tell you like that. And this is Aries and you got Libra. Yeah. You got Aries. You got Libra. All right. But this person is spying. This is your divine counterpart. This person is going to charge in. When they get out this energy of trying to figure out who they want and juggling, going back and forth, and then this Herman and Four Swords energy. Mm hmm. Yeah. They're going to come in and start this new beginning. What else, Spirit? What else, Spirit? Page of Wands coming out again. It's okay. You got the Eight of Wands messages coming in soon. You got Libra. It came out again. Mm hmm. This person went through a rebirth. That's why they've been insecure. And they kind of guard it, but they also coming in to fight for this too. Yeah, I told you they come in to fight for this. You got the seven of swords. They guard it, but they coming in to fight for it. Them, th these are two fighting, pretty much fighting cards to me. Mm-hmm. They come to fight for this. Yep. Six of Pentacles. They want this equal give and take. Mm-hmm. Tempers is here to bring a balance to the situation. So that's that's y'all reading, honey. Somebody want to come in. Okay, this person wants this equal give and take. And this is somebody that handles their business. And they know they got to come in because this nine of pentacles, whoever this person, this person respect, I ain't going to even lie. Whoever this person that's on your mind, they respect you. Especially if you're single and you're taking care of yourself and you good by yourself. This person know they got to come in correct. <laughs> it's as simple as that. They got to come in correct. This person, um, they want this reconciliation, but they also, um, they still been, they still kind of sort of been going through some, 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 some rebirth energy because this is why they've been in that in that hermit mode hermit energy and getting down low some spirit this is taurus this is the, the a direct connection with spirit this is somebody that's very this religious and that read their bible and stuff and but probably a god fear man mm -hmm. but they've been waiting but they're ready to use they want it's a lot of passion okay so you got taurus you got virgo you got sagittarius uh you got um yeah, you got, you got, yeah, this person right here, you got Leo twice, okay? Because you be dealing with, you could be dealing with Leo, or, or Libra, or Taurus. Uh-huh. They want this reconciliation. They're going to take this risk. They weighing their options. They in hermit mode, getting down low some spirit. But they want to, they're making a judgment call to come in. But they using their strength. It's going to take their strength because this person is insecure. I'm telling you, that's why that nine of swords came out. Not nine of swords. The nine of wands came out. This person is insecure, but they want they want this to be a success. You got the four of wands, okay? You got the six of wands, the three of cups, and the four of wands. This is stability, okay? Not only is this stability, this is, this is your twin flame, and this is a resurrection. This is a uh, reconciliation, okay? You got the two of cups, and you got the six of cups, okay? Again, this could be a pregnancy because I got the ace of cups. I got the sun. The three of cups, the two of cups, and the six of cups. Okay. Okay. So this, yeah, this person been wishing. And then you got the other, you got the wish fulfillment. 
Then you got the Ace of Wands. This is passion. This is going to be a passionate, loving, loving, stable new beginning. This is the Apex card. You're going to have all the love that you want. Okay. All right. So this is what I got. Okay. This person. Let me see. Yeah, this person. And sometimes, you know, and what I'm seeing is this person is in their head a lot. Okay. So since this person is in their head a lot, um, they, they have a hard time making decisions. They go back and forth. That's what that two of pentacles is here. They go they go back and forth weighing their options. Should I, shouldn't I? If I do, and what 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 they're going to think and why I took, what, are they going to accept me? If Are they going to still, let, are they going to let me come in? This is what they be thinking. This is what stops them, okay? All right? Let's see what else I can get out of this, okay? This person was carrying a heavy load. Mm-hmm, that was heartbroken. Mm-hmm. Yep, you got the lovers. You got the queen of pentacles. You got the knight of pentacles and the queen of cups. This person, the slowest moving knight in the deck because they've been hurt. Okay? You got the queen of pentacles, the ace of pentacles. They're wearing their options. The lovers, Gemini. Mm-hmm. The slowest moving knight in the deck. Mm-hmm. Three of Wands, they've been waiting, but they're going to charge in. But what's hidden is this person been through an ending. They had to walk away from something. They was feeling left out in the cold. Could have been a job. Mm-hmm. Could have been a job. Okay. So, there y'all go. Let's see what's going on with the messages. Let's just get a few messages and see what's going on. This is what's on their mind. This person said they want to see you. Mm -hmm, I believe it. Within a few months, I'm staying away from you because the last thing I want to do is hurt you. Okay, because this person is still healing thoughts. I've been, I've been in my head about you constantly. This person said they're unavailable. Mm -hmm, they say taken. Mm -hmm. something or someone is standing in between us right now so some of these people have not went through an ending yet and they will be going through an ending but the whole time that they're going through this they're wondering are you going to take them back when they come okay they're saying they're not available and they say something else, something is standing in between y'all right now mm -hmm. that third party what else I miss you rejection i'm uneasy about myself i don't know if i'm truly if i can truly make you happy this per i told you this person was insecure yes you got the sun card and you got the yes so this is a go whenever this this person probably ain't went through this ending yet some of them haven't went through the ending but for the other ones they have okay and this person whoever whoever haven't been through the ending yet they will be coming it's a yes but whoever have already been through this, the ending and when went through the process and grieving or whatever, it's within a few months. Mm-hmm. Within a few months. Yeah. But they're still insecure. Oh, yeah, they're still insecure. Let's see what's going on. Blowing a kiss, unconditional love, giving and receiving fairness, love and affection, healthy choices, uh, self-love. Take care of yourself right now. This person is probably taking care of themselves. That's why they're getting, they're recharging their batteries. And then that hermit energy and that four swords energy because they're healing, okay? Making healthy choices and loving life and loving themselves, being happier, taking care of themselves, okay? And they're cutting ties, moving on, um, progressive, arriving, sunglasses, Stalking, like that, like I said. Um, grounding, stability, security, performance, growth, and endurance. Yeah, they're going, they're going through a major transformation right now. They're healing their heart, okay? So just know that the person on your mind, abundance. That's why that Ace of Pentacles was there, okay? The Ace of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. And they, the karmic relationship, okay? Resentment, triggers, perception, intensity, and letting go, turmoil, fleeting. That's it. That person going through a karmic situation right now, okay? And that's why they're unavailable because whoever this karmic is, they are not nice. They, this person will will probably cause some issues that this person finished going through what they're going through. But for the other ones, 
this is for the person that's this this the, the energy that's saying that they're not available but for the other ones this this person this person would be coming in within a month a few months okay this per and then this karmic relationship got the end this person is fine on you mm -hmm. yes they are and um not necessarily social media all the time they probably riding by your house if they know where you live okay let me see do y'all want some more messages hmm let's see what the care for that you know i don't be fooling with this care for that like that but let me see what's going on with this care for that <laughs> I don't be knowing what be going on. Okay. So let's see. Let's see what's going on with the Kipper deck. What the Kipper deck got to tell us? Spirit, what you got to tell us through the Kipper deck? Ooh, a lot. Toil and labor. This per person working hard. Somebody working hard. A message. Okay. And a privileged lady. Okay. That's that nine of pentacles, honey. That nine of pentacles energy. And this person... This person and the eight of wands had came, the eight of wands came out, so this person gonna send you some messages. And but but they working hard. Yeah, this person working hard. Yeah. Not only are they working hard physically with their job, they're working hard mentally because they're going through a rebirth. Mm-hmm. What else, spirit? Is that it? You know, I don't even be fooling with these this kip of that like that, but Okay, I think that's it. That previous lady is that nine of pentacles. This person going to get ready to send you some messages, okay? Unexpected income, okay? Um, hey, I got to show you that. that that's all. And sudden wealth is right behind it. Listen, all right. You got a wealthy man and the previous lady, okay? And you did see the emperor, the emperor did come out. Okay, let's see what's going on with the romance angels. We haven't used these in a minute. What's going on with the romance angel spirit? What's going on? What's going on with the romance angels? Woo! Okay. Retreat. Okay. Spence, it's time to disconnect from the world. Okay. Calling in your soulmate. Okay. Letting go of control issues. This person got to let this go. Express your love, okay? You're going to be able to express your love with this person because this person is going to come in, okay? All right? This person is got to let let things unfold naturally, okay? Just be patient. That's why the temperance card was here, just to be patient. Retreat. Uh, time to disconnect from the world. That's what this, these, uh, these other messages was telling you. Yeah, these other messages was telling you um, pretty much ground yourself. Healthy choices, retreat, take care of yourself. Take care of yourself while this person is on their way back. It's time for you to worry about you. Ooh, and abundance came out. Abundance came out within this deck too. And you got, oh, this is nice, y'all. You got the wealthy man. You got the message, the privileged lady. And you got, okay, toil and labor. But you also had those wealth cards. What they at? Yes, unexpected income, sudden wealth, abundance. Look at that. You see how that relates? And then you got um, express your love, retreat. So this retreat right here is time to disconnect from the world. And so I'm going to put that with the grounding, healthy choices, healing. Mm-hmm. So you got retreat, healthy choices, self-love, okay? Grounding. That means you need to take some time to heal. Whoever this person is, you are this person. It can go either or. Y'all need to take some time and heal. Okay, ground yourself. Make some healthy choices. Let go of control issues. Let, thing, let the universe go ahead and finish doing what they're doing with this connection. And y'all, that's y'all reading today. Okay, I just wanted to come and just, you know, do a fast reading. So you just to check the energy, I will be back to do some more collectives. And not only am I going to be doing collectives, I'm still, again, I'm still on my Taurus Tribe um, vibe, but... We're going to, um, uh, it's time for us to expand. And it's okay. I still love my Taurus tribe. They know they always have access to me. But at the end of the day, it's time for everybody else. This is a yes. You have the sun and the yes card. So, um, again, I love y'all as a collective. I love y'all. I do. That's just who I am. I can't help it. And, um, 
I'll be back with another reading soon. But this is the this is the person that's most on your mind. This is what they're going through, or this is what you're going through. Take it how it resonates. I love y'all. Thank you for coming to my channel. Like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for again coming. Thank you for coming. I love y'all. Bye.